Until now, collaborating on content using directors hasn't always been the easiest. We have comments and revision history with accountability, but actually collaborating has largely happened off platform. There was a small risk. You would hit safety changes after someone else and override work, and there was no good way to work on draft updates and saving without publishing. We have taken great care to build content versioning in the director's way, being both super powerful while being unobtrusive to your workflow. Rather than talk to you about it, let me show you. Here I have an articles collection where I've enabled content versioning, and this is an item within the particular collection. And here we have a pill or menu, which is the main entry point for us to go into content versioning. Here we can create a new version. I'll call it draft as the key and my draft as the name. Now I'll change the title, add a new cover image. And for the content, I'll just follow it up with an enemies. Here I can save the version and we'll go back here. We can see the main item is not updated at all, but when I view my draft, I can see my latest changes with a new cover image and content. Over here, I can promote the version. When I see the changes, by default, we we'll select all of the changes from your new draft. And when I click on the preview tab, we can see what will be the changes that I will be promoting to. And if I would like to keep the same cover image over here, you can see I will go back to the old image. But for the demo purposes, I'll choose two cover image and content to be updated with the title remaining as the same. And when promoting it, we can choose to delete, keep it, and I'll choose to delete it. Now, once promoting, we can see the title remain the same with the cover image and content updated to the new one that I've just added. You can also use our new content versions API to do what we just did in the data studio. If you have content versioning enabled on the collection, accessing the item like normal will always get the main version. To get a specific version, use the new version parameter with the key provided when you created the version. And over here, it will be the test. And this data is from the test content version for this particular item. To promote a content version, you have to first create a div, which will return a hash, and provide that hash to the promote endpoint. Content versioning also exposes new events which can be used in Director's Alchemy, that's both in host extensions and in flows. A cool tip is that once you combine content versioning and live preview, you can view non-published changes in your pages before you sign it off. And that's content versioning. 